LifeSet has your political roundup from the weekend. President Trump delivered a speech at the Apex Summit Saturday honoring Americans' veterans while several Vietnam vets stood with him on stage. The vets were given the chance to say a few words, many of them thanking the president for his continued work. But perhaps the most touching moment happened when a Vietnam vet cried on President Trump's shoulder. The speech comes amid Trump's 14-day trip in East Asia. More than 200,000 Facebook users boycotted the NFL this Veterans Day weekend over the kneeling protests. The Boycott the NFL Facebook page outlined its mission, saying that supporters will, quote, not be watching or listening to NFL games on November 12th in solidarity with veterans around the country as football players have continued to disrespect the national anthem, the American flag, and everything our nation stands for. Only three players kneeled for the anthem during the Giants 49ers game, and reports say only half the stadium seats were filled during the Chicago Bears and Green Bay Packers game. Controversial Philippine President Rodrigo Duterte will sit down with President Trump for the first time Monday. Duterte is known for directing strong and offensive comments at former President Barack Obama and for his terrible human rights record. The rogue leader even boasted about murdering several people at gunpoint, sources say. Trump is expected to confront Duterte on his human rights record, although Duterte allegedly has no interest in that conversation. And lastly, the Republicans' tax reform bill is expected to pick up steam this week. A tax writing Ways and Means Committee party line vote revealed 100% support among the GOP with no defections, according to The Hill. Some amendments include a 9% tax rate for some small business income and the restoration of the adoption tax credit. The bill is expected to pass on the House floor, but still faces an uphill battle prior to reaching the president's desk.